Hello boys and girls, welcome to our math class today. I am Claudia Gail Rose. In today's lesson, we will be identifying numbers 0 to 10 and placing the numbers 1 to 10 in serial order. Boys and girls, I will be showing you the following numbers, 0 to 10. Please say them after me. Look carefully at them as I call them. Are you ready? Let's go. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Let us count some objects now. How many apples are here? Great job counting apples. There are five apples. How many teddy bears are here? Great job counting teddy bears. There are 10 teddy bears. Do you remember the numbers from 0 to 10? Let's see how many you know. Look at them and call them. Good job! That's the number 6. Great! That's the number 2. Wow! That's the number 8. Good job! That's the number three. Well done! That's the number nine. You really can identify numbers. That's okay if you did not get all of them. I want you to look at a group of objects I will be showing you. Count them, then tell which number matches the number of objects. How many balloons can you see? Which number tells how many balloons? Did you say the number four? Great job! There are four balloons. Here are some triangles. How many triangles are there? Which number tells how many triangles are there? Is it the number five? Six or seven? Awesome! There are seven triangles. Here is the number seven. How many smiley faces can you see? Which number tells how many smiley faces are here? Is it the number five, six or seven? Did you say five or did you say six? There are five smiley faces. Here is the number five. Look carefully at the number here. What number is it? Yes, it is the number nine. Which number comes exactly before the number 9 when we are counting by 1? Awesome! The number 8. What number comes exactly after the number 9 when we are counting by 1? Well done! The number 10. Let's call these numbers now. 8, 9, 10. Let us do another one. Help Michael determine which number comes just before 4 when counting by 1. Very good, the number 3. Now tell him which number comes exactly after the number 4 when counting by 1. Wow, the number five. Let's count using all three numbers now. Three, four, five. 
Let us now place the numbers from 1 to 10 in order. First, let us review our counting scale from 1 to 10. Go ahead and count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Great job counting! Boys and girls, we can place a group of numbers from the smallest number to the largest number. For example, 1, 2, 3, and 4 are arranged from the smallest number to the largest number. We can also place a group of numbers from the largest number to the smallest number. For example, 4, 3, 2, 1 are arranged from the largest number to the smallest number. Boys and girls, let us now try to place numbers from the smallest number to the largest number. Susanna was given the numbers 5, 3, 6, and 4. Help her to put them from the smallest to the largest. First, boys and girls, identify the smallest number. What number is the smallest here? Wonderful! The number 3. Now, let's identify the largest number. What number is the largest? Very good! The number 6 is the largest. Now, let us place the other two numbers. Which of the two comes next after the 3 when counting by 1? Great job! The number 4. And then we place the number 5 after the number 4. Let's call all these numbers now from the smallest to the largest. 3, 4, 5, 6. Here's another set of numbers. Let's call them. 8, 10, 7, 9. Can you place them from the smallest to the largest by yourself? Great job! These numbers from the smallest to the largest are 7, 8, 9, 10 when counting by 1. Let us now place these numbers from the largest to the smallest when counting by 1. Here are some numbers. 6, 5, 8, 7. Let's identify the largest number. What is the largest number? Yes, 8 is the largest number. What is the smallest number? Good job! 5 is the smallest number. Let us now place the other two numbers. Which of the two numbers should I place after the 8 when counting by 1? Remember, we are counting backwards. Great job! The number 7 and 6 comes next. Here's our final activity for today. Joanna is playing a game. She needs your help 
in placing the numbers 8, 10, 7, 9 in order from the largest number to the smallest number. Think about the number that Joanna should place first. Now give me all four numbers in the correct order from the largest to the smallest. Awesome! They are 10, 9, 8, 7. Was it that fun, boys and girls? I really like placing numbers in order. Did you enjoy doing that too? Boys and girls, when placing numbers from the smallest to the largest or the largest to the smallest, first you identify the smallest or the largest number in the list, then identify all the numbers that come between them. It's that easy, boys and girls. Remember too, if you want to do well at identifying numbers and placing them from the smallest to the largest or the largest to the smallest that you have to practice counting. Let us review the numbers now from 1 to 10. Here they are. Try calling them without help. That was great counting from 1 to 10. That's all for today, boys and girls. You did an awesome job. Have a great day.